Okay, Sam so Tommy Woods, yeah. thank you for in meeting us through pencil. Um, you've, you've attended today's Screenwriting Festival, it's the second year it's here, it's becoming a bigger audience. Mm -hmm. What do you think is the important aspects of the Screenwriting Festival? Um, it's important for me because I feel that um, you know Matt and I were strong collaborators and I think it's good to show um, screenwriters that that collaboration um, you know, can be um, equally important to, to both the director and um, screenwriter, but I think often, um, you know, scriptwriters can be sort of slightly sort of marginalised, and, and I think that, um, you know, showing how well we work together is to set a good precedent so that that doesn't happen so much. Mm. Well, no, no work boy, hearing what you were saying in, in Dawes, they, there seems to be quite a lot of potential legal issues about not using other people's content or mm -hmm. replicating things that weren't in the public domain. Yeah. Is it becoming increasingly more of a minefield to make a film? Um, I think making a film is um, a miraculous thing because um, you know it's literally an alignment of the stars, not, not of the actors' stars, but um, you know, trying to get, get the um, you know the synergy between the writer and the director, the um, you know all the cast and and all the um, especially if you're making a film about a real someone who's existed, mm. that's very difficult because yes, you are in a minefield of uh, mm. of legal issues. But I think um, you know a lot of what we were dealing with was in the public domain. There's been a lot of biographies and and so yeah, we I think um, managed to navigate it pretty well. Yeah, yes, I think you certainly did that. Yeah. And obviously the film industry is a very important part of the British economy now. It's, it's, it's almost 7% of the G GDP of this country, of creative industries together. But if you were Prime Minister for one day, what would you do to help boost the film industry and the creative industries generally? Well, I think, um, you know, the important thing at the moment is that, um, you know, that we obviously um, have enough funding for films, that um, films can be made in this country, but, um, you know, strong funding for young writers and first-time filmmakers, because I was a first time filmmaker and I was luckily you know supported um, but I think I think that's quite difficult to get your first film up and running but you know the UK film fund is pretty good for that and finally what what do you look for in a a script? What jumps off the page for you? Right? Really it's a vision. I mean I, I've read lots of scripts and, and what I don't like reading is a formula. I think a formula um, jumps off the page and bores you a little bit and, and for me, uh, you know, I read I read a Cassavetes script recently that was written in, I can't remember, sort of 74 or something and it's so raw and so real and the characters are so intense and so well written and, and you know, there's lots of sort of mistakes in, in sort of scripts world. Mm -hmm. of, yes. of how to write a script, but it didn't matter because I could see and visualise it and I think that's the most important thing, you know, not to worry about how it's laid out or who it's going to appeal to, but just to have a passion for it is the most important thing because I think directors um, pick up on that, they can feel the passion if it's there. And reflected in the film. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Sometimes we'll thank you very much thank for your time you. and help. Okay, thank thanks you. very much. Thank, thank you. you. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks.